meantime, though, I would like to introduce Rob from Extinction Rebellion and Louis from Just Stop Oil, uh, and they're just going to send a brief uh, but very, very important message. So uh, thank you and welcome to them. Good afternoon, everyone. I want to talk about uh, two people who are the earth, who are the logic of the earth, and who today were sentenced to three years and two years and seven months in prison. I want to talk about two very close friends of mine, Marcus Decker and Morgan Trolland. I remember the day Marcus came to this country from Germany and he walked into the XR Act Arch Factory with nowhere to live, barefoot. I remember first working with Marcus and we walked 120 miles together from Birmingham to London to protest against HS2. We worked together against HS2, all of us, we worked in XR, we worked in so many different campaigns together, we've developed together, we've played together and we've taken action together and we continue to support each other. And today they were given an incredibly unjust sentence. And the lawyer said, the judge said, it was to deter other people from copying them. And that won't work. Not because anyone will copy them, not because anyone can copy them, because they are individuals, but because they are the earth. And we are going to keep rising up we're going to keep following their example, iterating their example, taking it deeper into ourselves. Please, please come away from the big one with a renewed sense of strength. We've worked in so many campaigns. They worked across so many campaigns. We are here all together. It has been a huge, huge feat to bring all these groups together to agree to occupy the same space. Don't ever be divided. Unite to survive. Hi, my name's Louis. I'm from, uh, I'm from Just Stop Oil. <laughs> I've taken action with Morgan and Marcus a number of times now. Um, and honestly, I don't know what to say. It's fucking ridiculous. Two years, seven months and three years for peacefully standing up to their right to live. What is happening in this country? We actually have a quote uh, from Morgan here that I'd like to read out to you. Marcus and I demonstrated what any two ordinary people will do when the death screams of the world become unbearable. I cannot enjoy liberty in a society when our government makes plans to kill people on a massive scale. Drilling new oil and gas wells in 2023 means death for many of the most vulnerable on earth. I will not be complicit in that. These are two of the strongest people I know, and even in the face of these sentences, that is what Morgan said. Sentence, sentences like this, they're designed to scare us off. They want us to run and to hide and to quit challenging them. Well, we're not going to do that. We're not going to stand for it. We cannot stand for it. Morgan and Marcus have laid down the gauntlet. We're not going to let it fall. You know, in my eight and a half months in prison, the best, the happiest I was is when there were solidarity actions for me, both, both for Inch Lake Britain and for Just Up Oil. Now we're going to do the same for them. And we're going to do it bigger and we're going to do it better than Solidarity Action has ever been before. Now my question to you is, are you with me? Okay, I'm going to need you to follow JustUpOil.org. We'll give you updates on the action as it's planned. We'll let you know very soon. Thank you so much for being here and for witnessing this moment. <laughs> 